Hi, I'm 90210office.com, and I can cut your overhead by 90%. And I'm Office Space. Real Office Space. Whoa, you sound a little bitter, OS. Well, shouldn't I be? Ever since the economy has turned down, a lot of my tenants have been switching to your virtual office. Well, it makes sense. Ah, you think I suck. Well, yes, but that's not just it. You see, since you're no good, we're fascinated because we have no idea how you've come as far as you have. No idea how if you decide you want to make Plan 9 from Outer Space meets Leave it to Beaver, they'll let you do it. And they'll count on me to throw a name like Roy Conroy in so it'll sell. Jim, don't you realize that the big names that I managed to get for you are the only things that save your films from box office catastrophe? Gee, wait. Don't you want the people of China to have the same opportunities that you've had here? That Caroline has? Is that what you think the premiere is here for? Opportunities? I thought you'd be in Washington already. Yeah, I just, uh... I just wanted to come by, you know, and... And thank you for doing something I know was very difficult for you to do. And to apologize for putting you in a position that you didn't deserve to be in. It's more than you're going to get from anybody I work for. And don't flatter yourself. I just happen to be waiting for an important letter. You were supposed to turn in your key to the super three weeks ago. I would have called you if any mail came in. Did you open my valentine? How do you know it's not for me? Because you don't live here anymore, Mitch. God, you're so creepy. I, I, this is exactly why we broke up. Now give me the key. Prison without trial. War under false pretenses. There's no clear indication that anyone has really noticed. Ladies and gentlemen, Melissa Osborne noticed. Wait, I thought her name was Melissa Chase. It is. It's... She changed it to her maiden name for the trial. God damn it, Madison. Have you heard a word I've said? Yeah. I'm hearing everything you're saying. I'm just making sure you get her name right. She's my client. How could I not know her name? You know what? I'm just trying to be helpful, okay? Okay. Well, thanks. But I'm gonna go work on this in the office. Goodbye, Mitch. Fine. That's it then? Maybe I just, maybe I just like the idea of us more than the reality. When will I see you again? Why does this keep happening to me? We provide our clients with a Beverly Hills address, a receptionist that will forward your calls, and access to one of our state-of-the-art conference rooms for $165 a month. We have a copy machine. Yeah, so do we. Kitchenette? Yeah. Uh.